So these are blocking diodes. Um, this is what it looks like. Uh, the, you know, this, this is a heavy duty one. So you uh, solder. This is a piece of. This is 10 uh, electrical cable, which should be uh, ample for what I need to do for it. Uh, so I've soldered it onto the uh, the positive side, the anode part of the of the uh, blocking diode, and uh, you know put a on the end of it. And then you know this is the other end here. Uh, this could go into a heat sink also, but you'd have to return that heat sink side. So this is going to go in line with the solar panel. Uh, positive lead is going to come down onto this line throw through the diode and then down to the positive side of your battery um, so this will prevent any spikes from uh, the PMAs either a wind turbine or a water turbine to backing up into the panel uh, so this is a, a little bit more prettier it's I didn't have any heat shrink tubing that small, so just use electrical tape to cover over this edge. Um, and then I'll put it into a box, which I'll probably show later when I get on customer site. Um, so this would be for each. You wouldn't, unless you had a huge system, you know, you would, um, if you had a huge system of solar panels, you'd probably want to go with, uh, a larger one. I think this was I'm trying to remember what amperage it is. Um, but if you go on the WANS site, you'll see them um, and they'll give you the rating of what they were. Um, and then I also was today, I was also doing was I had to convert this, was a DC, um, had a DC plug right here and uh. This uh, rectifier was actually installed inside the PMA. When I ordered the PMA, I forgot to specify that I wanted it to have the three wire output coming out of it so that I could run it um, as three wire down the pole um, over to a, uh, a rectifier. So I had to remove this one from there and then attach you know a wire each into it and then I shrink wrapped it and clamped it on there so that it's a little better if you look on there are some videos that show you doing it also so and it wasn't as bad as I thought it'd be it was just it's just something else I had to do <laughs> to make it work so uh, and uh, you know, I shouldn't actually be showing you my medications over here. Hopefully no one's paying attention to it. I'm diabetic, so I have, you know, medications that I'm on. If this is my internal workspace. You've seen my outside workspace. You can see that I probably get into trouble having the living room as my workspace. But uh, this is a panel that I, I have uh, built and rebuilt for... Uh, a system uh, that used to be in the barn. The barn was upgraded and uh, all that's missing there at the moment is the uh, inverter which I took using it on a customer's system at the moment. Have a great day!